What's up guys, this is Armand. And this is Mario. And today we're going to show you guys how to SSH into your iDevice. And what this means is you will be able to transfer files from your uh, computer onto your, uh, onto your iDevice. And uh, you can transfer files like ROMs uh, for uh, games like uh, the GPS phone, which is the Game Boy Advance emulator, as well as uh, other emulators. You can even transfer in your own themes and a whole bunch of stuff. But first, uh, we're going to tell you what you guys need to install. We're going to install Open SSH and Automatic SSH. Uh, we'll provide for you the spelling down below. And then right after that, we're going to go onto the PC to install WinSCP and we're going to direct you how to do all that and Mario's going to take over from here and tell you guys what you need to install from your iPhone so first you're going to open Cydia and yeah okay so the first thing you want to do is install automatic SSH so we want to type that in oh it's right here, it has a space So we want to install that. Return to Cydia. So the next thing we want to do is get, well I guess I should have just left it. Uh, no, it's open SSH and this one does not have a space. So it's right here. I guess I didn't uninstall it. It's weird. Okay, and that's what you guys need to install. So open SSH and automatic SSH. We'll provide for you the spelling down below. And now we're going to transfer on to the PC and show you guys what you need from there. Okay guys, so we're on the PC and we're going to show you what you need from here. So you're going to open up your uh, either uh, your browser. Uh, we're using Firefox, so we're gonna use Firefox. And then here on the Google search, you're gonna type in WinSCP. We'll provide the spelling down below. And then from there, you're just gonna go ahead and click uh, click download underneath WinSCP, or you can just go on the main site. It doesn't matter, but the quicker way is to click download and then you're going to click on installation package uh, bracket sponsored bracket and it now it will ask you if you want to save the file and uh, save it and also drag it to your desktop or save it to your desktop but uh, I already have this file so I'm going to go ahead and click cancel so I'm now going to close out of this and there you have it when it's CP. So what you're going to do now, uh, you're going to plug in your iPhone and uh, close out of iTunes when it pops up. Uh, make sure that, uh, yeah, uh, make sure your iPhone, iDevice is plugged in into your PC or Mac. Uh, you're going to open up Windows CP and now it's going to give you this right here, what we have. And where it says host name, you're going to type in your IP address. To find this, go to settings on your iDevice, click Wi Fi, and then where it says underneath choose a network, look for the network you're connected to and click the white arrow in the blue circle. And it should show your IP address. Uh, right beside IP address and you're going to type that in uh, most of them should start with 192 decimal and then you're going to type in the rest and then username it's going to be the same for everybody the username is root r o o t as well as the password it's also the same for everybody it's alpine a L P I N E. And once you've done that, 
make sure your port number stays 22, which is what it should be. Uh, there's no private key file. The protocol, file protocol is SFTP. And make sure allow SCP fallback is checked off. And you're going to go ahead and click the login. And this should pop up. And you're going to click yes. And there you have it. So on the right side is your your iDevice, whereas on the left side is your drive. So I have my C drive right here. And uh, you can transfer files from here into your iDevice. Or you can just quickly grab files from your desktop and just drag it in. So hey guys, in case you guys had trouble following with the video, um, we're just going to show you quickly how to get your IP address for WinSCP. So you just have to go into settings, go into your Wi-Fi, and uh, click on this blue arrow. And for security reasons, we're not going to show you. So uh, thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to comment, subscribe, and like. And we'll be back next time. See you guys later.